Here's how you can become a partner of a meta business portfolio. The first thing you want to do is to come into business settings here. You can easily get here from ads manager or just type business.facebook.com slash settings in your browser and it's going to bring you over here. Now you can become a partner of another business portfolio and get access to their Facebook account, their Instagram account, um, their Facebook page rather, their Instagram account, their ad account, their data sets and pixels and so on. This is very helpful if you are an agency. So maybe you run ads for other businesses or you are a social media manager or you just want to offer some form of service to this business and they need you to get access to their business portfolio. So the first thing you're going to do once you're over here in business settings is you need to get your business um, portfolio ID. That's what they're going to use to send you the invitation. So to get this, all you have to do is scroll down here until you see business info. And then you're going to go ahead and click on business info. So once this opens up, you would see your business manager ID over here. You can easily just copy it and then send it over to the person who is sending you the partnership request. Now, let me go over to a second business portfolio so I can invite myself in as a partner. To do this, you're going to go over to business settings on the account you want to become a partner on. You can also do this from, um, from your own business portfolio. And then you will click on partners. You will see it under the users tab. So once you click on partners, you're going to go ahead and click on add. And then you have two options. You can either give a partner access to your assets, right? So if you're working with a client and they want to give you access, this is what they will choose. Or they can ask a partner, send a request to a partner to share their assets with this business account, right? So let's use the first one. We want to give the first business manager account, this one, create the example, access to this business portfolio. So I'm going to click on the first one, give a partner access to your assets. Now, all you need to do is to put the business ID. Remember, we copied that earlier from business info. So you just need to put that business ID in here to send the request to that partner. Once you do that, you're going to click on next. And then they're going to ask you to assign everything you want that person to have access to. So if there's a Facebook page in here, you can go ahead and assign it. If there's an ad account in here, which there is, you can just assign it and give the um, permission level. If there's an Instagram account as well, you can add it. It just depends on all the assets you have available. And once you're done selecting everything you want this person to have access to, you're going to click on save changes. So let's give them a moment. And they said, one ad account has been added to the business, create the example one. So you can see now that under partners, you can see it here, create the example one, and then assets you've shared, um, the ad account is supposed to show here actually. So this must be a glitch from Meta, but you can just click on share assets one more time and then reshare the ad account. So let's do that and save. Perfect. So now it's showing that you have shared the ad account with them. When you share a Facebook page, an Instagram account, it's all going to show over here. So now let's go back to the business manager, the one we invited in, the one we shared assets with. And I'm going to go over to partners. And you will see that the request is here already that I've been um, added as a partner to this business manager account. And if I click on assets shared with you, it's going to show that the ad account has been shared with me, right? So this is how you can add someone as a partner to your business manager um, or your business portfolio. Just request for their business manager ID or business portfolio ID, and then you'll be able to send them a request. Now, if you want to do it the other way around, it's a bit more complicated, right? But let's say I want to request to be a partner of this business manager account. I'm going to click on come over to partners, and then I'll click on add, and then I'll click on ask a partner to share their assets. So that's what I'm going to click on. And then Meta says, adding a partner allows you to request access to their business assets. It also allows you to request access to their line of credit. It does not grant either partner direct access to the other's business manager account, right? So I'm going to click on get started. 
And then you're going to need um, like to put the name of the person you're trying to contact. You're going to, so let's say this is Priye. And then you're going to put the, their email address, right? So let me put this in. And then you have to put the business portfolio ID of the business portfolio you're trying to get access to. And then you go ahead and choose the role um, of your business in this partnership as well as their role. And then you can send um, a request, right? So let me just finish this and say my business's role is a media agency while the partner's role is a client, so a brand or a business, right? And then I'm going to click on next to request access type. Oh, okay, because I'm already a partner, it's not going to work. Let me just remove this quickly. Remove. Oops, that's the, that's the wrong one. Let me remove this and then we can start the process all over again. Okay, let's just wait. Perfect, so I have removed that account as a partner. So let me refresh this page and then we can try to request to be a partner one more time using the second method this time. Wonderful. So it's showing here now that we don't have any partners, right? And now we are going to partner to request, we're going to request assets from a partner, right? We'll click on add, just the similar um, method we we're following before, click on get started, add our contact name and email address, and then add the business portfolio ID. And then you choose your business's role. So I'm choosing media agency. And then my partner's role or the person I'm requesting access for, they are a brand or business. And then I'll click on request asset. And then this is where you now ask them for the type of assets and permissions that you want. So you say you want full control of their Facebook page, for example. You want full control of their ad account, for example. Same thing with the Instagram account, with the pixel and so on. And then once you're done, you click on next, confirm and review. Now you can add an optional message in here or you can just click on send to send this request. Great. So it's showing you here success. Your partner request has been sent. Once the partner responds, you'll be notified and prompted with the next steps. So let me go over to the business manager where that request was sent to. Let me refresh this page so we can see this clearly. And we should have a partnership request here. And then the other party is going to have to accept that request. So you can see it over here, new partner request received. You can respond to the request or you can decline the request. So let's click on respond to request. Click on get started. Click on next after reviewing the business information. So they are telling you the name of the account, when it was created, the status of business verification. So it's currently unverified and so on. And then you click on next. So you now choose which ones you can actually give access to. So as you can see, it's showing that they requested for full control of the ad account, but you can always turn off um, the full control permission and just give special access, right? And then you're just going to click on confirm and review. And then once you do that, you click on approve request. And that is it. You've approved this request and are now partners with Create the Example. So I've shown you the two ways, how you can add someone as a partner and then how you can request access um, to be a partner of someone else's business portfolio. Now, all this is not going to work if you don't have a business portfolio, aka a business manager account in the first place. So you can watch this video where I show you how to create a business manager account. It's a very simple process and you should be done in less than five minutes. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. I share videos with tips and tricks and strategies to help you run more profitable ads for your business. And I will see you in the next lesson.